You can place paragraph text using formatting in Revit Structure as well. So you can number or bullet a paragraph in Revit Structure. Let's have a look at that now. In 000 ground floor structural plan, I'm going to click in the drawing area and zoom in on this area over here. Now you can see our circular hollow sections. What I want to do is put a couple of little notes up here just to say that these circular hollow sections are used to support the flooring on each balcony. So I go to text again here, like so. I want text without a leader, so I click there like that. And then what I do is click about here, like so. Then I can select the formatting. So I'm going to go for numbers there, like that. And as you can see, when I click in here now, I've got a little sort of outstand there. Can you see where my little flashing cursor is? So this will say CHS sections to support balconies, full stop. When you press enter again, you want to check position before construction, something like that. Now, obviously, they're very simple. And what I do then is I go and click on modify and they're in there. If I zoom in and out, notice it's just a graphics card thing there. I just need to zoom in and out. Now, the nice thing is I can select that text and add a leader. So I want a left hand straight leader this time and it's pointing over here. So what I do is I click and I drag and I can drag that down to one of the circular hollow sections like that and then hit escape to deselect. And there's my leader there. Now, you might want to crank that up. So what you can do there is get that level to get it away from the grids there like that. And there you go. So there's your text with your number bullet points in there like so. Now, if I go here and click on this little button here, text types, I can go in and edit the text types if I want to. So you'll notice I can do that both in the properties palette and also in the text panel there in the annotate tab on the ribbon. So that's how you can place your paragraphed text and also edit your text settings in Revit Structure.